lang sa mga questions yeah. kanina. We'll just still be doing more Super Southies, especially sabi mo kanina, you will be busy with a big project in US. Um, yes. I, I'm actually sobrang yun yung reason kung bakit itong malaking project na nangyari is, you know, kung bakit siya nangyari is because of my Super Selfies. And actually, we're, I'm gonna be shooting a lot of Super Selfies here in Manila with various artists and yun, yun sobrang excited ako. Did you expect na talagang mag, masisikat yung mga pinagagagawa? Hindi talaga kasi <laughs> Kumbaga, puro kalokohan lang yun eh. Alam mo yun, parang extra energy. Like what my brother said, mag-isa lang ako sa states. So, wala akong magawa na... Wala, sa bahay lang ako, tapos school, tapos bahay, tapos school. So, inisip ko, kailangan kong ilabas yung, yung, yung talagang pagkatao ko sa... And I need to share it with the world. Malay ko ba na... Sige, sige. Reaction mo na mga pati Hollywood stars na gugustuhan yung Super Celtics. I don't know. Grabe. Yun yung talagang, yun yung, dun, dun ako na nagugulat kasi mm. parang it takes me less than 5 minutes to shoot a Super Selfie. Mm -hmm. It takes me less than 10 minutes to edit. Tapos post. Yun na yun. So, parang in my mind, grabe, parang it's, it's really, pag hindi mo na-expect, dun talaga, dun talaga nag-hit. Do you, do you feel vindicated? Yung sinasabi na hindi ka dito parang matatanggap sa Pinas, pero doon, um, boom. Yes and no, kasi syempre, hindi, hindi pa yun talaga yung ginagawa ko talaga. Um, pero like what my mom said sa May, makikita nyo na that, that is my, kumbaga, kumbaga ako yun. And it's, I'm so excited na lumabas na siya, pero hindi ko masabi. So, yun. Patuloy pa rin ba yung ginagawa mo ngayon sa US? Di ba? Yes, I graduate in June, pero I have plans on moving to Miami. No. Um, mainly also because of a lot of the job offers that okay. I've been getting because of that. That's super self. Uh -oh. Okay. So your career, mo, you continue na talaga sa states. Yes. Um, I, I also want to get into um, cinematography and, and you know working on movies. Mm -hmm. And of course, music. Um, yun talaga yung pinaka main focus ko. Yung super selfies, kumbaga, added bonus na lang siya sa akin talaga. Um, but, yes, I plan to continue there. But I'll, I'll come back for projects. And I'll, yeah, like this, I came back for this. Um, pero, I'll be based in the States. Gapas, video katiyo, parang no regrets at all na, kasi before, di ba, parang medyo nag-focus ka sa love life. Uh -huh. But this time, sa career, parang no regrets na wala kang love life ngayon. Um, I wouldn't say walang love life. So many. Yeah, yes, I am seeing someone. Um, Filipina? Filipina, uh, but she grew up in Australia. Uh, but I think it, it, I needed to go to the States to be alone. Mm -hmm. I needed to learn. Because alam nyo naman to. I mean, I've always had a girlfriend. Mm -hmm. And I would always talk about her. Kung, kung sino man yun. But I think I needed this whole year. Kasi sobrang na depressed talaga ako. I feel, I feel like I, I hit rock bottom sa States eh. Mm -hmm. Kumalisa lang talaga ako. I was very depressed. Hindi ako masaya sa ginagawa ko. Yung school lang talaga yung nag and family yung nag sa akin. But I needed to be alone to, you know, to be able to love myself, to learn how to love myself and to learn how to be on my own. Before I learn how to be with somebody else. Kasi ganun naman talaga yun. How can you find yourself when you're trying to find each other? Diba? So the moment I stopped looking was the moment she found me. So, paano kayo nag-meet sa... Three years ago, we met sa ASAP. Uh, we, we were introduced. Ay, talaga oh, dito na. Oh. So, so nung nagpunta ka doon, girlfriend mo na ba siya? Oh. Um, then, then, then. It, we, were, we just stayed in touch in the whole three years. Okay. Sobrang magkaibigan lang kami. Sobrang magkaibigan yeah. Sobrang magkaibigan lang kami. And then, um, something happened in her life na medyo seryoso. And I, I, I was there for her. And it exposed us to each other kung ano talaga yung pagkatao namin. And this was all digitally ha, as in FaceTime. Pero kilala ko na talaga siya. Pero hindi yung ganun ka-personal. And then, yun, one day I I saw her, she passed by LA, nasa LA din ako for, for a couple of days lang. And I got to know her and I realized this girl is, this girl is amazing. And I, and I think now, I am emotionally me and mentally ready for a, rela a real live relationship. So kung kailan kaya yan? Kailan kaya magmamaterialize? Um, it's, 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 it's in the process. I mean, it's already, it's already there. Um, we are actually 
legit. Like we're in a relationship right now. Mm -hmm. Um and unlike before, you know, you know in showbiz mahirap mag maging honest na. I mean, we're, we're friends lang. No, I think I've gone to a point in my life, especially since I'm based in the States, I shouldn't worry about that anymore. Um I'm, I'll be very honest with people about my relationship and my personal life. Uh, only because there's nothing to be ashamed of. Mm -hmm. So, gano ka katagal na yan? Um, we've been together for two months. Two months pa yeah. So, hindi mo siya kasama ngayon dito? Uh, <laughs> uh, she's just around. Yeah, she's just somewhere. Uh -huh. Wow! Yeah. Uh -huh. okay. What is she? Trisha. 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 What does she do? She's a vlogger. Um, she's a host. Um, she's an, she was an actress in Australia. Yeah, she hosts for a lot of like fashion, like ETC. And, yeah. So yeah, I I I've gotten to a point because if people ask me about my relationship, it's true. I mean, I post it on Instagram and, and you know I'm very open about it. So when do you plan to get married? Honestly, maybe in a year and a half, maybe. Um, I, I, uh, I know I've said about it. I've, I've, I've talked about my girlfriend before, and I always, I always told the press, I think she's the one. Da 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 da. Blah blah blah. blah. I'm not gonna get into that mode. All I can say is that number one, she's the most different girlfriend I've ever had. So bra kami magkaiba talaga, cause she grew up in Australia. I grew up here. And it's nakatawa nga kasi sobrang close siya kay Kim Jones. Sobrang close nila. Um, and Echo is, you know, Echo is one of my closest friends. So sabi nga sa akin ni Echo, sabi niya, sabi ni Echo, bro, baka, baka she's the one, sabi ko. Maybe. Tapos sabi ni sa akin, sabi ni sa akin, sakit sa ulo, no? Sabi ko, oo, sakit sa ulo. Bakit? Hindi, pero sa, sa kanila din, nag-uusap din sila. Sila din, sakit sa ulo mga Pinoy na lalaki, no? Talaga. They're so emotional. Kasi yung... Cultural difference. Oo, cultural differences. But I love it. That's what makes us us. And, you know, it, it teaches us about the world in a way. And, you know, I won't say that if you ask me if she's the one, I hope so. Um, I would want her to be the one. I don't know if I'm gonna marry her one day. But this is the first time na in a relationship na sobrang close siya sa mami. And she is the one that I could say is most alike my mom. Most wow. like my mom. Anong tawag niya sa mami mo? Mama Angeli. Wow, mama na. Mama Angeli. Ang bongga. At tapos si daddy mo. Ano uh, tito, tito para, tito para. Ano impression sa kanya ng daddy? Oh, my dad loves her. My dad loves her. Uh, she's been through a lot. Um, you know, personally and emotionally. Personally and emotionally. Pero sobrang strong niya. Parang mami ko. You know, my mama's been through so much. Patricia. 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 Thank you, guys. Super Thank you. This is for the Super